Lifetime Achievement Award is uh, obviously very humbling and uh, I'm very, very uh, appreciative and touched about it. When I think back in terms of how does one get to that, I think back in terms of my career as a, as a physician and go back to the days when I was basically a student and how we learned this craft and it isn't all in the textbooks. I think that uh, uh, the, the things that I've learned that have been most significant have been just things that I've learned from following people that I admire in terms of how they did their jobs, how they went through life, and it wasn't necessarily somebody who was in the medical profession. It was somebody who carried with them a sense of responsibility of doing the right thing always. And uh, I've sort of patterned my career in that manner, that uh, to me you can't move towards a goal as if this is going to be the end game and you will receive a an award at the end of that. You can't accrue it like brownie points, but I think if every day you get up and do what you believe to be the right thing and the following morning when you wake up you feel good about what you did the day previously, uh, then I think you are on track.